Hello again everyone, Deflect here, Firm But Fair Gaming. Want to say a big thank you to all the subscribers, uh, all the ones that were there at the beginning, and we have now reached a 2,000 subscriber milestone, so a big, big thank you to everyone. It is greatly appreciated, and it really helps out. Uh, so thanks for watching the videos, and thanks for hitting that subscribe button. Now, getting into the Star Wars this week, it is weekly reset. The reset is emergency operations, so... That just gives you a bit of conquest and it lets you queue for you know some operations and tries to get people into that. There's nothing uh, too crazy for this week, but you'll see like big reward for completing five different uh, conquest or five different operations. Sorry, in your conquest, which will give you 260,000 conquest points. So if you're after any conquest points or your guild's trying to do something uh, with the invasions, definitely check it out. Now. Um, getting into next week i forgot to mention next week will be swoop gang so i <laughs> look forward to that the racing is always fun and if you don't know queuing for the operations you can always queue through the uh, group finder tab this will queue for operations and hopefully this week will be uh, a little quicker on the tabs because sometimes they're a little slow or you can check the uh chat at the fleet because they're always looking for people there as well so getting into the reset as well it has changed so that brings up some new Items and yes, my inventory is cluttered. I keep saying I'm gonna get through it. I'm gonna look into it. I'm gonna go through it, and I never do. Eventually, one day it will happen. I just don't know when that will be. Uh, so they have a new mount uh, this week. So it's uh, the Chiss Talon Interceptor. It's not a bad looking mount. I believe this one's a rather large size one, judging by the starship look to it. So uh, be prepared if you use it. It will be a large size mount. This is also uh, available, which last week we had Paxton Rawl, if you all remember. I ended up uh, picking him up. This week it's Master Reno. So this he is available for a companion. You can grab him. He will cost you six Galactic Season tokens. Now, if you ever wanted an awesome looking sword, HK's 55 Vibro Sword is available as well. This weapon just looks mean, nasty, and it is great. I, uh, I thoroughly like the look of this. This is one of my favorite uh, Vibro swords out there. Uh, it just looks amazing. They did a really good job with this one. Uh, you can also pick up an uh, older pet. This one uh, was available way back in the day uh, as a little pet to have around. Another speeder. I don't recommend this speeder. You can get a whole bunch looking like this on the auction house. So don't pick that up. It is not worth three season tokens. Uh, personal opinion, of course, but uh, I do not recommend that one. Uh, you can also get a droid if you need it, or if you're looking for a droid for a companion, that's available. Worth one season ticket. Uh, you can get the nice looking gazebo. It's nice. I'm. I don't buy a lot of decos because I usually get a ton anyway. So uh, I don't buy a lot, but it is a pretty neat one. You can get the scout droid as well for one. These are way back and. They're kind of funny to watch go around. And then the title, The ri Risen. Risen? Risen? Either one. It's early in the morning and it's one of the two. So take whatever one it is with whatever you like. Uh, so that's what they have in the non-seasonal rewards. And uh, we'll be checking it out again next week. So, you know, look for that video. And if you have anything that you would like to see, leave a comment below. Thank you again for the 2,000 subs, and this was Deflect. We'll see you in the next video.